Hi guys, uh, I'm Jab and I'm here with Bitbox for another battle war. And we're down at our local store Wildstorm Games and I'm with Gaz. Hello. And we'll be doing a thousand points of my orcs versus his Dark Angels. So now I'll show you the thousand point armies. Hi guys, and here is my thousand points of orcs. So here we have Big Red, my war boss, in his battle suit. And we have then got a four man Meganob team. And they have Pain Boy, of course. And they are in a battle wagon with Kill Cannon. Oh, yes, of course, uh, Big Red has got Mega Armor, uh, Power Claw, and the Lucky Stick. Oh, he's also got Attacks Quick. And then we've got a Looted Wagon from the White Dwarf, which has got a Kill Cannon. And two or one Big Shooter, I think it's one. Then we have three more Mega Knobs inside it. We then have a six man looter team. Uh, yep, want we'll to get more of them because I love them. Then we've got two Death Dreads, there's my Carnifexes, and a, <laughs> a lone killer cat. So, yeah, again, that is a thousand points. Alright, guys, and here's a thousand points of Dark Angels. I'm bringing one Ezekiel to the field, uh, five of the Deathwing, one with a Cyclone, everyone else Power Fist, Storm Bolter, and Power Sword, respectively. Over here is my poor camera work and Tax Squad 1 uh, with a plasma gun. Over there, around the back, is uh, Tactical Squad 2, same again, plasma gun. Uh, Devastator Squad 1 with two plas uh, sorry, missile launchers, two LAS cannons, and a three man additional meat shield. And finally, the second Devastator Squad with four plasma cannons. And that would be 1000 points of unarmored Dark Angel. Alright, guys, this is our setup, and here we have Dark Angel Squad. We've got some uh, Devastators here in this building. We've got Ezekiel and another squad here in a nice arrowhead formation. And then another Devastator squad, the plasma one there. We then have the Orc lines. We have got Death Dread there. Lewitt Wagon there with three Meganobs in. The War Boss and his Meganobs in the Spout Wagon. With then Sneaky Death Dread there. Then have some looters on this building here, and right behind them is our lone killer cat trying to stay out of line of sight. And Gaz, of course, did indeed see, uh, get the initiative. I'm going to now attempt to seize it if I can look at dice. Aha! Uh -huh. And of course, I did not at all. And we are now playing Relic, and this little crate in this crater is indeed the Relic. Maybe it's some kind of fallen brewed alcohol. And yeah, so now we shall. Uh, oh, yes, Ezekiel Psychic Powers. He did indeed get. They are, in fact, a version of Maelstrom of Misery and Mindworm, as well as the Mindworm Primaris. So there you have it. And he's keeping his warlord trait. Courage of the Lion. Yes. Courage of the Lion. And I have some brand, oh, yeah. like a Thunderbolt. There you go, orcs. I don't care about my warlord trait. <laughs> and so now we shall go into uh, Gaz's movement. Yep. All right, here we have the Dark Angels movement. Now this tactical squad has uh, moseyed up here. Trying to seize cover behind the wrecked rhino. Devastator squad, of course, stayed in this building. And Ezekiel and his arrowhead are pushing forward to the ale. And that Devastator squad stayed over there. Now we've got to bear in mind, they do indeed still have a squad of Deathwatch Terminators, uh, Deathwing Terminators in reserve, which of course won't be coming in just yet. So now we shall enter the Dark Angels shooting phase. Psychic. Oh, psychic phase, sorry. Oh yes, I have psychic powers. <laughs> Shots are 
And on the psychic dice, you get a grand total of five over my masculine eight. eight. All right. Um, yeah, everything's out of range. So glorious psychic phase is indeed over. The best psychic phase ever in the history of the Dark Angels. <laughs> the best one for the orcs. Nothing attacked us. <laughs> All right, Dark Angel shooting phase. Okay, as the bolt guns can't exactly damage any wagon in range, I'm going to run the first squad. A mighty four whole inches. Not too bad. And this squad, a colossal five. Alright. So we'll get them over and then we'll go to the actual shooting with the Devastators. Right, yeah. Gaz is indeed firing that Devastator squad into my poor looters who are hiding in this bastion. That is not Bastion. Okay, so we'll just use the two Laz cannons first off. Surprisingly, Ooh. they both hit. Two's to wound. And surprise them. Ah. Uh, the we'll be indeed getting a cover save. So. Which he did make. Survives. So. And the two missile launchers from the same squad. <laughs> well, get them. One's out of the way now, shall we say. Dark Angels, mate. Dark Angels. The looters are still alive. Laughing. And we shall attempt the plasma cannons on the looted wagon. Looted wagon or the battle wagon? Oh, the battle wagon. The battle wagon. Yeah. yeah, that one. <laughs> so. Alright, we've got all the gets hot. Typical. One, of course, does. Okay. <laughs> one has indeed died. Dark Angel's plasma. Ooh. Why well, don't we got a scanner over there? I do indeed. Okay. So here we got the plasmas. So shot one. Uh, miles off. So four that way, which yeah. unfortunately it is going to be off. It's miles away. Shot two. Direct hit. Direct hit. And third shot is also a direct hit. Is, yep, another direct hit. So two of the three hit. Okay, guys, we had a complete mess up mode, of course, there. A battle wagon, of course, has a front arc uh, rating of 14, and humble plasma cannons cannot hurt them. So, instead, we're applying them to hits to the looted wagon, which is right next door anyway. Because so. I screwed up. I screwed up big time. <laughs> but it, it wasn't just him, oh, it was me too, so there you go. So now we'll apply it to the front armor rating of 11 for the loot wagon. Okay, so one of four is a glance, and that's two penetrators. It is indeed. Oh. So, results. Yep, he's an AP2, which has one to a chart, and it is open top. But his dice rolling is consistent, and he merely rolled a two and a one. Boost um, up to a three and a four. Indeed. So it's pretty much crew stand. Oh dear. But it's now down to one hull point now, but he would have liked to have uh, popped that open. Yeah. Alright, so Orc's kill can has uh, snuck up around a bit here. Death Dread snuck around here. Battle Wagon's moved up. Loot Wagon's moved up. And the Death Dread's moved up over there. That was the Orc movement. First of all, we've got to roll the loot of wagons, don't press that. So on a d6, he has to move flat out on a 1, which of course he did. So he now has to move flat out. So he's just there, uh, he's moved slightly closer to the ale. The mighty ale. As an old player, I'll start with a bang. So my kill cannon for my battle wagon shall attempt to uh, disrupt the arrowhead formation. Direct hit. So that's going to be fairly nasty. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, I think. Can't get the back two guys. So this is strength seven, AP three. So killing on twos. So that is six. Six Dark Angels have been removed. Uh, he's now two big shooters, which is now snap firing at the same squad. So sixes. Nope. Now the battle wagon done. Death Dreads, two big shooters into the same wounded squad with Ezekiel. So fives. Oh, three sixes there. And three ones. So. 
Do these harm? No, of course not. Don't even worry about it. Right, now I've got to roll for the looters guns. And we get D3, so we get two shots each. And just pass the inch range. Actually, yeah, leaves us. We cannot literally hit anything because I can't see the majority of them due to the ruined rhino. So, okay, so, and Lou was up there just looking pretty. This Destroyer's gonna fire his two big shooters into the Death State unit, which is in range now, but pretty much that. So, six shots, hitting on fives, two. I am actually wounding on threes, yeah, I realised I messed up previously. But that's all right. Two ones. Yep. Get him out of the way. Good. Get him out of the way early, mate. Last thing shooting. This killer can's big shooter. He can see the tail end of that squad just, and he's in range. So he's gonna fire. I hit him with fours. So two good. We're doing threes. So that is one wound. So one armor save. Another one armor save. <laughs> is another dead angel. We shall now make a morale check on the Ezekiel squad. And they're loving it, sticking ground. Right, so this is the board after turn one. Now, we have already realized we've been making mistakes. Um, yeah, some big ones. Oh dear, we're so bad. It's been a while for both of us though. So yeah, Dark Angels are still sneaking up here. Devastate is still hanging out there. The only really thing that took potential losses really was Ezekiel's squad. I realised I should have disembarked all my mega knobs and like maybe seized the relic or charge, but hindsight is a wonderful thing. And then that stays over there. So we then just got look, Death Dread roaming up over there. And our little wagons and this Death Dread here as well. And hopefully maybe the lone killer can might actually do something. So yeah, that was our spectacular turn one of errors and kerfuffles. Oh, kerfuffles, yeah. So we'll try and do better in next turn. So now this is turn two. Forgive us, Craig. Dark Angels, yep. Yeah. Sorry, Craig. Right, first of all, we have some reserves. So here comes the death wing. Oh, they're coming, all right. No, it's a free. On a really blurry dice! <laughs> Free! So, yeah, that means we'll be having some reserves, which we'll now quickly place and... Uh... I shall attempt there. Where is the scatter dice? Be all through. Blue scatter dice. This is a risky old shot. But they love oh, it. Direct hit. So this... now we have some uh, Deathwing Terminators threatening the poor Death Dread. Blues. Whoever. <laughs> oh, of course, yeah. Got mega boxes and guys in there. Okay, down to movement then. Yep, so now we'll do the movement and we'll get back to you afterwards. Now, so, okay. we have done the movement though, so we'll just quickly <laughs> recap that. This uh, Dakish squad have begun to seize cover in these ruins to advance up into the Orc lines. And Ezekiel's squad is nearly at the Blessed Ale. So, there we have it. Now we shall do the psychic phase straight into that. So magic number is one. One dice. So best going good. Ever. All right. Okay. I shall now put two of my four warp charge into a version onto the battle wagon. Oh. Uh. The scary battle wagon of boom boom, which goes off once. I will attempt to uh, deny this with one dice and knock Nazi <laughs> Uh, but I don't have that, so... Oh dear, Scary. this is going great. Righto, you're better wagon for now when you fire snapshots. Until the no. end of the next turn. Uh, can't use that, can't use that. Psychic phase over. Okay. <gasps> Mighty Ezekiel, he has... Rather than being blurry when I zoom in too far. <laughs> he has done well. Kind of. No, do not be silly. <laughs> so now we shall get to the Dark Angel shooting phase. Alright, yeah, so our mighty Dark Angel player is contemplating his shooting actions. 
that's our... Okay, yeah. first of all, I think we're going to put two plasma shots from this squad into the front of that thing. To the poor Leo Dwagon, who's down to one hit point now. Okay, only two of these fellows can actually see through the window, so we're going to go with that. Yep. And the top rolls. One is... Look at that one. He survives, Aww. so we're lucky here. Thank you, Jim. So. You're a peach. Yep. Right First shot. Oh, only shot even. Scatters. That way? Meh. Yep. Yeah, by one inch. So yeah, so, so and scars literally like there, so it's still a hit. Now, it's front armor 11, so strength 7. So a forward glance, and no. Oh right. there. My dice hate me. So that was that squad there. Uh, Ezekiel squad, they you shooting at anything? Running together? Uh, go for it. Alright, so is this one or two? Oh jeez. Uh, yeah, this is this is how good we are. Two uh, d six. We're rusty, very rusty, and pretty much. Yeah, that was not good. There, if anywhere. So. Yep. Uh, wobbly model. Okay, we know he's there. Yep. So basically, the front three are on the edge of the rims there, towards the ale, and Ezekiel and the squad sergeant are so by. So, uh, Deathwing Death Death Terminators. We're going to fire the Cyclone Missile up into the Lugas. We're going to be using the no. Crack ability. So, this is Twin Linked. Which I didn't need. No, so both hit. I believe the Cyclone Missile is our strength 8, but I will double check that. Yep, Crack Missile is our strength 8. Oh, I don't smile. <laughs> I remember that. <laughs> so, two? Oh, come on. <laughs> So, take a cover save, my Get a cover save. And I got a three, which doesn't do it. So, one has gone down. Yeah. Which I'll take it. So, that was the cyclone. And I will use the four, four storm bombers into the same group. Okay. Right, let's get a death wing assault. Okay. Seven out of eight. Yep, so not bad. Strength four. Indeed. That's four. Okay. And two. Oh. Mm. <laughs> and fire up cover saves. And that is one. a three and a five. I make one. Oh, oh, oh one. Sorry, <laughs> a five. Ooh. So another one has been removed. Whoop. Right, we've got these two chaps here, just on top of the building. You can see the looters up in the 40 bit. And so here we go. So both hit. That is two hits. And a strike four. And that is two wounds, surprising. Indeed, I'm, I'm gonna... Now to a gas dice here, because they appear better. And uh, that is one cover save. So yet again, another looter has gone down. Yay. Which makes me sad inside. I got one. So these devastators are going to attempt to open up the battle wagon. Battle wagon? It's yours, not mine. Yes, yes, my <laughs> battle wagon. I, I forgot what it was for a moment. So. Okay, first of all, we're going to see if the missile launchers can actually do it. So we've got a hit first. One does. So now he'll be glancing on a six. Glance on a six with a crack. And a fail. But he does have two last cannons in there, though. And the last cannons. One hit. And glance only five. Oh uh, no. So I do believe that was all of the Dark Angels shooting. So how does that make you feel inside, guys? Very ill. Mm. Very ill. <laughs> all all the pain is coming. Yes, we've been uh, doing rather well, both of us. So now we get into the assault phase. Will there be any assaults? No. <laughs> right, so. Yep, so. Ox. Turn two. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's turn two. Wait! Not Ox turn two yet. We have a morale check on these looters to do. So. As they have taken. Lots. Yeah, three casualties. So. 
let me see, do we succeed? And that is a four. So two, two, which apparently makes four. So yes, we succeed, hooray! Now, onto Orcs, turn two. Yeah. So Orc movement's done, Mr. Death Dread Red has walked up to that fence. The wagons walk forward and the mega knobs have exited. We're gonna try and flank Ezekiel as the war boss as well and his squad have exited the battle which moved up here. And this Death Dread and his buddy the Killer Can has roamed up here and Alutas stay put. That was a mighty orc movement. First of all, don't press that. I'd appreciate if he didn't move forward now because he could hurt his own guy. So, oh my god! <laughs> Oh god, that's a one. We're moving forward apparently. So that's a flat out movement. Yep. So he literally, no matter what I do, will shuffle forward and hit them two guys. Not that I actually feel it really does anything, so I'm not sure if you can tank shot your own guys. Hmm. So quick. So yeah, we checked it. it is just a flat out it performs, it's not a tank shock either, so it literally just pushes forward and they get like Slightly pushed out of the way. But, yeah, so, kind of disappointing. It would be amusing to run over my own guys, but I'm thankful not to. So, now on to proper orc shooting. Rock and roll. So, Death Dread Stupid Shooters into Ezekiel Squad. Soften them up with the boss. So, fives and sixes, which is two. And threes. So that is two more wounds. Only AP5 though. So two armor saves. Two armor saves, let's see up. So they made it easily. One, okay, there's a five and a five. Two fives. Massive. So six twin link shooters into a sequel squad. So hit on fives, but get to re-roll. So I hope that's went. No. No twin link, no. Oh, a mighty free. That's some orc marksmanship going on there. So, freezer one wound. Okay, as Ezekiel is currently the closest bottle, I will tank it on his two up, which he makes gloriously. Just. Just. Yep, so next, this unit of Mega Nobs and War Boss will fire their twin link shooters into the squad. <laughs> Say this. Two, four, six, and eight. Like ten. Uh. Uh, oh, that's bad. Oh, this is painful. Oh, very nice. Lots of sixes there. So, needs to strength four, eight, four, so fours, sorry, not threes. I'll re roll that. Right, so that is three. Three more wounds. Okay. Three armor saves. And, and they're all fine. Three armor saves made. Alright, Battle Wagon's kill cannon is going to attempt to soften this squad. So, somewhere over there. Is that and the big one there? From yeah, it's uh, fire and snapshots. Oh, yes, it is. Oh, you're completely right. Uh, fine. Then, as we're not firing the kill cannon, because I forget. So he's snap shooting big shooters. He's gonna to attempt to snap shoot into the terminators. Why not? Wow, wow, wild one actually hits. So straight five. So that is a six. That's a wound. Come on, guys. Don't disappoint me. Here comes a one. Here comes two ups. Oh. Yay! Survivor. Death dreads, big shooters, two of them into the terminators again. So fives and sixes, so that is only three. Freeze, so that's three fives, so three more wounds. Come okay. on, just give me one one. Here comes all the ones. <gasps> A one! The Emperor protects nobody. Ha 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 ha. Oh, now I feel sad. No, this kill can, uh, kill can? Oh, yeah, I wish they could. <laughs> this killer can's big shooter will also fire out of the surface. You monster! Hit on 
fours, so two runs of the six. And one wound. Come on, give me another one. This is the one dice. Oh. Oh. Get rid of that dice. Good night. It's gone now. No. And lastly, these looters, so roll it three, and we have two dice each, because that's three. So, as there's only three of them left, six, and they're going to attempt to soften up the Terminators. So, fives and sixes, two hit. Now these need two wound, one wound, because I roll a one and a four. What's the AP on that? Oh, uh, AP like five or four. So okay, so the two up armor, we need it. Yay! Success. Now on to the assault phase. Arrgh. They're charging into Ezekiel's squad. So I think I'm definitely in. Yep, definitely in. I'm going to have to get some Overwatch on that though. And today we're going to also charge into Ezekiel's squad. They're also definitely in. Yep. But I, I, I'll let you choose who you want to Overwatch against because. Okay, I think just out of principle, I will overwatch these fellows first Go for as it. they charge first. Okay, I'm good. Now we have the overwatch from Ezekiel squad into Big Red squad. This will be the four marines, Ezekiel I'll do separate. So, one whole hit. That is a biz wound. We are toughest four majority in the squad. Okay, then so. four I need, which I get <laughs> not. Ones again. Typical. And Ezekiel with, I think it's a master crafted bolt pistol. There he is. I'm going to. Right, here right. We, we got Ezekiel's master crafted bolt pistol, which is <laughs> master crafted, thankfully, which is still an embarrassment to the Dark Angel Order. So Big Red and his squad are indeed in there. And then we've got them, them other mega knobs. No one cares about them. <laughs> <laughs> Big Red! Big Which, red. of course, I will issue a challenge. Ooh, uh, uh, Ezekiel will take it. Yes! Ezekiel on Big Red action! Well, he's bold. Subscribe now for all the extra details. Pay per view! <laughs> Pay per view. This is pro wrestling now. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Any more assault? <laughs> Why not? Death Dread will attempt to get into the Terminator squad. So, obviously they'll overwatch Ooh. 6 to 11, minus 2. That Straight will up. be enough. Okay, overwatch from the Cyclone Missile, because it's the only thing I've got. <sighs> nice! Dark Angel, yeah! And uh, Stumbles? Oh, of course, no, no. I can't have because I'm a mighty Death Dread. <laughs> Uh, nothing else can charge, so we'll... So, here we have the combat. We've got Ezekiel protecting the Holy Brew versus Big Road. And then the rest of the squad are sort of being mobbed by Meganobs. They're rolling. So, it's a good fight. And then now we have the Death Dread has swarmed up there. So, well, of course, did issue a challenge, as you've previously seen, and Ezekiel has accepted it. Because Gaz is a man, and real Dark Angels are real men, and they accept fights. Or run away. Or run away. So, yep, we'll now get into doing that properly. Right, the Dark Angels have superior initiative, for they are Marines. Filthy and yep, so they go first. I'll get Ezekiel to have a, have a go at initiative step five against Oh, so Big First Red. of all is the challenge, Ezekiel versus Big Red. So this is weapon skill five against please. I am weapon skill something. Um, <laughs> five, yes, <Okay>. yes. <laughs> it says so in the codex. The codex is starting. See, just there. <laughs> so forced to hit. This is a master crafted four sword. I see a one there. Which is a three, so that's only one hit. Yep. 
Unfortunately, you didn't actually cast Force, though, did you? I did so. not, because it never occurs to me I'm going to be assaulted by orcs. Hmm, who <laughs> would have known? Ho, ho, ho. I am toughness, something that is also five. See, still says there in the codex. <laughs> Yeah, guys, you, you can tell we're, we're taking this seriously. We're not even drunk, you know, that's how amazing we are. We're super ethereal, okay? Super ethereal. Okay, so... Okay. So it's still a four to wound. Sorry, a five if he's toughness five. Yep. Which is a wound. It is indeed a wound. At AP three. So I get a top save. Damn. And I got six, so that was good. Next goes the normal marines. Normal marines, and because of Ezekiel's book of salvation, everyone within six inches of Ezekiel friendly gets plus one attack. Ooh. Which is quite, quite, quite vicious. Nice. vicious. Vicious, vicious, vicious. It actually makes him worth taking. Hmm, doesn't seem too bad. Okay. So it's free for the sergeant, and how many's left? Three? Uh, one, two, three more marines, yep. Six for the other three. Uh, weapon skill four. Yep, this will be the unit. on all the surrounding knobs. Yeah. It's so, uh, not a bad roll. I'm assuming they're weapon skill four. Yes. Okay, so that's that's pretty good for me. And their toughness, if you would. It's toughness four. Okay. Four is the wound. And that's a masculine three. Three. Three two ups, followed by them feel no pain. So, we got oh. a five, a three, and a two. Oh. We're good. We got this. Five, five back. So, now we have the pain boys attacks. So, four. So, he gets two. So, that's one there. And he's just strength four, but he's got poison four plus. So not that matters. Four either way. So, that is a five. Yes. It's one five. So. One armor save. <gasps> the pain boy killed one. Oh. Fear him. And now we go to initiative step one, which is everybody else. So now we're continuing the rest of the challenge. So Big Red versus Ezekiel. Come on. He's got five Big attacks on charge. Come on, man. It's weapon skill five. So that's three. He yep. does have an attack squig though, which Ooh. lets him re-roll one. Which oh. he does. So oh. that is now four. Now these are strength... Ten! Yes, of course. Uh, Insta-kill. Yep, strength ten, AP two. Insta-kill. So... That's it's one dead Ezekiel, two dead Ezekiels, three dead Ezekiels, four dead Ezekiels. As that spills out to the but rest of the group. Does he have an invan save? No. Which is brilliant, isn't it? Hmm. Okay, maybe he's not that good. He isn't. He but is. he's now dead. He is abysmal. Come away, Orc. So now we consolidate because our brew, not yours. So, Big Red consolidates three, and the other Magnol squad consolidates two. So, so now we have this fight with the blue Death Dread against the Definitely Terminators, as the monster creature goes at initiative, so he is initiative two, with two power claws, which is a certain amount of dice, which is four on the charge. Thank you, Codex. Which is nasty. So he is weapon skill four, versus weapon skill four? Yes, sir. So here we go. Come on, fours. So two. Straight for 10, AP. AP. Yeah, monster creature, 2, 1, whatever. Uh, so that's 2. That's so, two. Big bomb saves. 5 up, big bombs. Come on, be good, be good. <gasps> oh, I hate you. <laughs> yes. She indeed died. So much So now we have one left who does get to pile in there and return it. Oh, his pile is going to be piling. So, here we go. Weapon skill four. Yep, that's my weapon skill four. Damn. A six and a one. 
the extremes of the spectrum. Okay, in power fist, that puts them up to strength 8. Yep. Against the frontal. Front of 12. Okay, so four to glancer. Oh, I hate you. I hate you so much. Yeah. So, I won. So, leaderships. Uh, yep. Leadership, minus two, which is bad. So I do believe he has failed there. Yeah. So now it's initiative check. I assume walkers can run down. I can't remember. Uh, For the sake of this, do you want to say yes? Yeah. <laughs> so initiative check. After all our balls up, sir. So, <laughs> so Death Dread's initiative of Mighty Two. Against the four. four. So I got a three, so that's five in total. Seven. And he's got seven, so he does actually get to run away. Okay. So, we'll so he runs six inches and I consolidate five inches. Oh! So this is what the board's looking like at the end. We've still got Death Dread roaming on this quarter edge here. We've got right in the middle where the brewers. Big Red and his boys have secured it, and that Meganob squad heading after these Plasma Devastators with the Looted Wagon in support, Battle Wagon securing the middle, Terminator still running away but being chased down by the Death Dread. This Killer Cam here protecting his Looter brothers, but maybe it just might be able to eventually do something. Oh, he did a kill Terminator, didn't he? Yeah, he's actually done well. And the squad, and then we have this other Death Star squad here. So that was a bloody turn two, I do believe. Yes. So going well. Yeah, tears rolling, and still we're making mistakes. You broke my heart, man. <laughs> but we're having fun. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying it so far. So now we shall get on to Dark Angels. Turn free. What's left of us? Right, and uh, so we've had the Dark Angels movements. Yeah, again, them devastators are pretty much just still stayed there. Uh, he's decided he doesn't like the Death Dread and moved away. He just wants to play. <laughs> These guys, meanwhile, have uh, mounted the building or yeah, you know, got there. Uh, them devastators have stayed there. Mm. So we shall see if the Dark Angels can pull this back. Right, so we're starting yet again with the Plasma Cannon guys. See if they don't kill themselves this time. Oh, come on. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. Hey. Oh, so. He's a survivor. Been keeping consistently getting hot though, so. Where are our Templars? And Templars. Oh, that's oh, a good point. Behind you. Excellent. There you go. Mm -hmm. They so, are. Targeting these guys. All three will target this fellow in the back here. Which would be direct hit. Yeah, direct hit, so one hit. So that's free tote. Mm. Oh, that's terrible. Six inches that away. Oh. Which might hit someone else. So it's kind of that angle. Uh, actually, I think it misses. Just off. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm actually going to call. I think it hits a looted wagon's edge. So. Okay, so if you want that, then yep. just put that aside there. And then the last hit, a shot even, is a direct hit. So that's six hits here, one hit here. Yep. Groovy. Okay, so we'll do the one plasma cam shot that drifted onto the wagon. And that is appalling. Two, so seven, eight, nine. Right. Yeah. Appalling. And then the six, four, the e, big mega knobs, mega knob fellows. Yeah. So that's Assume. one, two, three, four, five. Five. Hmm. This is AP two, isn't it? Plasma I do game. believe plasma is stroke seven AP two. I hope that's right. Yes, it is. Correct. So that means we have one knob there left with one wound. <laughs> So, whoop, become pain. So he's going to need a morale check. Uh, then we will move up into this devastator squad. Oh, 
Stoke we are Squad. going to fire all the heavy weapons at that lovely Death Dread thing. Uh, yep. So we'll fire off with the last cannons first, because it's always a good choice. Unless you're a Dark Angels player. Going well. Then the missile launchers, firing crack. Which is still going... Well, at least you hit with one. Swimmingly. Front and armor 12. So that's a forward glance. Oh, I got a pen. I got a penetrator. Oh. Oh. Roll for it. The grand effect is five. Ooh, I do believe that is weapon destroyed. It is five. Weapon destroyed. Awesome. I got one. So, one of the random things, roll a d6 on a 1 to 3, it's a claw, 4 to 6, a big shooter, it's got two of each. Okay, so, okay, that's a 2. So that is one of the claws, I said? Yes. So, yep, so he has gone down one hull point, and he has lost the claw. Oh. Yeah. That... So here we go. Got this fellow here with his wonderful plasma gun, that he's scared of. Fire Indeed, you can <laughs> see that. The Guess shit. it's done the pose where uh, the it's got the hand towards the. Uh, the vents and what's he's looking away? The classic pose. Everyone's favourite. Overdone. Uh, and he's attempting to kill my poor killer cat. Okay, so we're well in rapid fire range. See if we're getting hot. You're kidding me. We're getting hot. We're he surviving. still lives. We're surviving. Okay, what's the front of your can? It's 11. They're 11, so for the glance at. Oh, broke my heart again. So, that squad, shooting's done. Yeah, shooting's done over there, so we've pretty much just got the cyclone launcher, which is going to try and pop that death dread, because I hate it so much. Two hits, which Indeed. is a very nice change. Front number 12. And force the glance. Yay! So we have a pen and a glance. So the penetrator does. Reroll that. It's cool. Oh, I don't have to reroll it. A six. Ooh. So immobilized. Yep. So and that's... it was already wounded. They have three hull points. So he is dead. I killed something. So I killed kill something. A Whoop. Is gone. Oh my god. I killed yeah. something. You didn't do too bad in the end. Champion. Right. So that is the Dark Angel shooting over. And there will be no assault phase because. I'm miles away and firing heavy weapons everywhere. So, we shall now have a quick look. The situation still hasn't really changed too much. I have forgotten, but just realised I do need to do a morale check for that lone Megan up. Make him boogie. Um, so, 2 to 6 is 5, which. Well, he has a pass. He has a pass. So he took casualties. It's not that bad. So, yep. On to Orcs, turn three. Three! Right, so here we have my mechanized grots movements. The Death Dread is still coming up along this flank. Um, Mega Knob and his looted wagon moved up there. Gonna uh, threaten them devastators. The war boss is moving up here with his unit. The pain boy has separated and he uh, is holding the ale. Um, the bow wagon moved up here. Maybe put a kill can shot somewhere. The killer cans moved up here. And as usual, the three last three lures are staying there. So, on to orc shooting. First of all, don't press that on the third wagon. My god, he did not press a one this time, but he did get two. It's close, but he no longer has to move flat out. So I can actually fire his kill cannon. <laughs> right, kill cannon shot from loot wagon onto the So, come on. Please, miss, please, please. Oh my god. I'm bad, actually, uh, might hurt me. So, What's there? And that is moving six. <laughs> <laughs> so it bounced straight back at us. It's gonna hit my mega knob and the wagon. Oh yes. So 
Megan, what's the pain, my good man? Meganon, strength 8, AP 3. So it does wound him, and this will instant kill you. He only has one wound anyway, but he does get his two up armor. So he is still alive. And to the looted wagon, this is ordnance, so that does something. <laughs> um, I believe you roll 2d6 and choose the highest, if I remember correctly. Um, strength 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, so that is a pen. Either way, as soon as I did one point of damage to him, he was gone. So it doesn't explode. No. No explosion. So, that was good. His own battle wagon shot. His kill cat shot. That was good. I feel pretty good about that. Yeah. Grot marksmanship. Really the best. Nice. Best thing ever. Moving on. <laughs> so, is that one wound? Still. So, his twin link shooter from him. Onto Devastators. Uh, twin link. Good thing for twin link. No. Never mind. He's gonna run four inches. So he's gonna scuttle up to there. Shooters. Twin link shooters into raw lone terminal. Oh no. Why would you be so cruel? I've got to finish him off. So fives. Ouch. So they were the hits. And rewards. Three more. So these are strength four. Four. Or five. Um, so fours. So that is five more wins. Okay, and if we come back over here, I shall do the two-up armor, or not. Oh, he made it. Okay, the Emperor protects him. He has one jammy son of a gun. Ah, uh, this kill cannon. He's gonna attempt to uh, stop them inefficient last cannon shots. So they really are inefficient. Scanner is a direct hit. Oh, so. One, two, three, four, five, that's six, seven. Entire squad. Yeah, that's all of them. Eight, right down to the bones. Five, six, seven, eight. Ordnance, wow. yeah. This is, yep, strength eight. AP three. Yep. Strength eight, eight, four. Two's to powder. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You could go to ground. Three. Six up. That's why it's ordnance, isn't it? So how many was that? Seven? Seven. Okay, I will do that. Five, six, seven. Okay, everyone in there is going to ground. Unless we do count that as like area where we need cover for normal fire or cover saying. Well, I don't know the rules for ordnance. It's about that seven. I can't remember. Okay, so because we're out of sync with modern edition, we're going for a fire or cover with this ruin building thing. And yeah. Okay, so five die. Take it from the top and point of the blast. Oh, I'll get my camera in the right position. So, and it's a good thing I had that three man meat shield. So I can say they're not all ended, but they do now need a morale check if they can survive the next the snap shoot big shooters out. Big shooter time. Sixes. One of them hits. Excellent. A spinning crater. Spin the crater. That is not a game, girls. Aww. Guys and girls. But, uh, that is one more wound. So, normal eight. Arm save. Yay. Of course. I got one. Uh, this killer can. Hitting on fours. Where's she shooting? He is shooting, sorry, the squad right in front of him because I intend to charge. Very well. So, one more. And that is a wound because it's strength 5 AP5. Very well. And that's an armor save with my and jumpy arm. Last shooting. Three looters up there. That's Naz guns or whatever they are these days. Ah, them. Sorry, you're going to get one shot. Whee! This is good. So that is free. Which, remember the AP this time? 
strokes they've made before, that's it. Okay, so I still get three armor saves. Yep. Which we'll do here. And that is three, three armor saves. Very lucky. Death guns, not snaz guns. That's what death guns. Death guns. Okay. And that is a. Okay. So, assault phase. He declares an assault at the downstairs. Okay, I would say it's about a three inch charge. Um, Sarge will. It's about four. Sarge will overwatch with his bolt pistol. Which he, oh. he gets. I am quite shocked. And typical. Close, no So. I'm in. I'm well in. Easily in. So he up there. Plop him in there. The wards unit is going to charge the lone terminator. We'll be firing two cyclone missiles, um, which he missed both. Yep. For some reason, I'm holding the blue dice with me. Sorry. And I need a final charge. And I'm easily in as well. Yep. And last of all, Killer Can is attempting to charge that unit. Which I'll put two. Uh, the plasma guns. guns. Yep. Plasma gun. Which doesn't Blues. get hot. No. And I got a free inch charge. Which isn't even up a building, is it? No, it's two for the terrain. But uh, be removed. So just out. Any survivors? Yep. On to the assault phase. Whee. Okay, so initiative step, give a three inch pile in. Yep, Just initiative one. Pretty much everyone getting in, having a piece. Yep. Have a go. Oh, God. And because I'm watching through the camera, I have no depth perception. But there we have it. Two for the Sarge. Three for the Marines. And weapon skill four, is it? Yep, weapon skill four. That is a grand total of three hits. Yep, I'm um, tough as well. And two wounds. So, two two ups. Bust. So, there's a three and a two. I'm happy with that. Crump them. So. <laughs> yep, do we need four attacks on charge? Yep, three attacks naturally. So, power four. So, hit them on. Fours. Two's to kill. Two's to kill. So, two are dead. Okay, and we'll take two of the closest. And he does not want to stand up. And that orc does not want to be wounded. And I can't see. Uh, <coughs> you fail that. I fail that drastically. So, leadership minus two. So I'll re-roll that because it's yeah, cogs. Uh, seven out of nine or ten. So you're still fine. So it's still good. So yeah, that's locked in combat. Whee. This unit. Uh, we're all going at the exact same time. Yep. All power fists and whatever. Yep. So I'll allow you to uh, roll your dice first. Okay. You have to roll a lot more. Okay. So that's one hit. Good. And one wound. One AP, is dead. An AP2. So that's one removed. Uh, he still, still gets his attacks though. Oh yes. This is where we're going to die. So this is normal main knobs, including the one just died. Oof. It's still, so it's still I need quite at least one two in this, really. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So seven, five ups. Okay. Okay, uh, four, five, six, seven. Whatever first, yeah. Oh, and he's dead. He's gloriously oh, yes. screwed yes. over. Consolidate four inches. And a masculine four inches. How's the assault phase over? So this is the end of Orc turn 3, I believe. Indeed. And uh, as we've seen from previous experience, this is not looking too good. 
Um, the boys, Megan Orbs, whatever, that have crumped the last of the Terminators are now advancing towards everyone else. Uh, Killer Can's still sitting around doing its thing. We have a battle wagon rolling up. A constant combat ensuing here. And enough of Death Dread slowly marching the field. With the Pain Boy still holding the Wonder Hill. Okay, now it's on to our wonderful turn four. Indeed. Here we bloody go again. Right, and we've had the mighty Dark Angel movement, which was literally nothing but this squad hunkering down in this building. Ruins to try and uh, survive as long as possible. Run to cover, bro. So, yes, on to Dark Angel's shooting. Uh -huh. So, we'll so straight into that. If we'll run straight over here, I have two missile launchers still and a sergeant with yep. bolt pistol. He'll be firing his bolt pistol into the Meganobs. Yep. Which is a drastic failure. Oh, that's a hit. No, it isn't. I'm freaking Tyranid. My fault, my fault. Uh, a four to wound, which <laughs> is a drastic failure. Surprisingly, Dark Angels never wound when they want it. Okay, two missile. I'm not salty, by the way. I'm not salty. <laughs> no. Uh, two missile launchers firing cracks into the same squad. Yep. Which again. Oh, one of them does hit though, and, and this will be instant killing a Megadol. Uh, yeah. Which is indeed. Oh, what is the AP? Cracks AP three. AP three. Oh, okay. So I get two up. Try big, I'm on a five. Broke my heart again. Yep. Okay, so I've got still there. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight marines, one plasma gun in there. They're going to annoy, ignore the killer can now and focus no. their attention on the mega knobs. Yeah, I'd have probably done that too. So I'm going to put the two, we're going to fire the plasma gun first. Emperor protect. Yay. Oh, hits with both and doesn't get hot. Emperor protects. And that'll be two for you, sir. Yep. Um, closest to Closest actually might be Big Red. It's kind of hard to say. Yeah, I actually think he's slightly full closer, the uh, normal one. Alright, yeah, we'll go with that. Uh, either way, though, I have no invuln in the unit because Mega Knobs don't have invulns. Oh, okay. So, whoop! He's dead. Okay. That's two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, sixteen. Is it? Yeah, eight, eight, two, yeah, sixteen bolt gun shots. Six, Here comes their salvo. Fourteen, sixteen, exactly. And all the ones, which is pretty much what I was getting. Mm. About oh, slightly over half. So, here. just over 50%. Uh, Store majority of toughness for the unit. God damn it. And fours. Oh, two. Two. So, two two ups. And there's a four and a six. Oh, so. failed again. No, can't stop Big Red's tide. Big Destruction. Red. Big Red come with you. Yep. Right, so. and I guess we're moving on to the assault phase, which is pretty much just going to be this group here. Indeed. Okay, so two for Sergeant, one for the Devastator. Ooh. That is an insult. So, one. Yep, and for the wound, which does so nothing. Wrong. And see if we can put see the Dark Angels out of their misery. Crump them. Crump them, crump them. So we've got Take a one, one a four, we'll do all that. and a six. So two hits, that's that's all I need. As long as I don't roll ones, which of course is a one there and a three there. So one is dead, and I do win combat. By one. Yeah. So we shall have a little leadership. It's passed. It's fine. So it's passed. The right. combat continues. Uh, Not that I could chase him down. I'm no. Slow and personal. <laughs> Uh, on to Orc turn four. What's the magic one? Right, so 
us orcs have uh, moved forward a bit. Um, pretty much the Death Dread here is just, yeah, again, waddled forward. It's not done much this game, but yeah. Bane Boy still holds the brew. The Batwang stayed there. Most notable thing is Big Red has detached from his unit and uh, is heading towards the Devastators. He's actually a bit more forward, but wobbly model syndrome. And these Mega Knobs are going to help the Killer Can, who's literally just waddled up to the edge of the building as well. So, onto the Orc shooting. Time to party. So, looters, I get to roll a D3. So, one shot each. So, they're going to attempt to uh, weaken that unit with one hit. I get twos, so that is one wound, but you get. Save. Oh, oh, kill one off. Indeed. Front of most fellow. Not my plasma. Get a cans, big shooter. Into the same unit. There we go. Oh, two hit. Out of focus. And oh. two wounds. Because that's strength five, eight, five. Okay. Two free ups. And of course. One more down. One more dies. Megnob unit, then last two guys into the same unit, three link shooters. So one hit, I get to re-roll, so one hit, fours, one wound. He's he lives. Saved. It's a miracle. Two big shooters into the same unit. Hit on fives, so only one hit. Big bomb freeze and doesn't wound. Oh, last thing. Oh, yeah, that wagon. That wagon. It's a bit risky, but I could. Tell no, not. I'm just the hell. Fire. The two bad, the two big shooters on that apple okay. you know. <sighs> Which I only get one hit. Free and uh, doesn't wound. Okay. Very last thing is Big Red's Twin Link Shooter onto the Devastator. So one hit. One hit. And that is not a wound. Okay. So, that was our shooting phase. But I'm an orc, I like the assault phase. Alright then. So, onto the assault phase. Who's going first? Big Red declares a charge on that unit. Okay. Two missile launchers on Overwatch, fire and crack. That is. Not a hit, two and a three, and Sarge's bolt pistol is not a hit. And I can actually re-roll that. That's my warlord trait. Yes. Just check it's not just one dice. All the dice when you're turning rival charge. Because he has the warlord trait like a thunderbolt. So actually mad at this time. But I'm in there plenty. Yep, I'm mad at that. He's in there. I'm not sure. Just shoveling forward. Yep, the killer clan declares a charge, first of all, onto the unit. Yeah, okay, as the killer can's the first one to go, I'm going to have to overwatch with the plasma gun. Which hits once and gets hot. <laughs> it's hot, yes. So it gets hot, oh. keeps the angel alive, and the hit. Front armor 11. Glances. So, yep, it's a glance. So he takes a wound. And then he gets in. Okay. And the two Mega Knobs also are going to charge the said squad. And they are also in. Groovy. Ooh. I'm actually going to attempt to charge into that combat with the Death Dread as well. It's a long charge. I don't know if he fired then he fired at them guys. Yep. Sorry. Yep. Don't worry. We're good. We're good, man. Yep, we're good. We, we won't talk about that. On to assault phase, properly. Right over. Where you want to begin? So we'll start there, try and finish him off. Okay. Um, you go first. Um, yep. So that's two for the sergeant. Hitting on fours. Which one goes in? Wooden on fours. Which does nothing. Two attacks. Two hit. Just need twos. And he is dead. Dun dun. I consolidate five inches towards your deployment. So, uh, let's do big reds. Attacks in there. So, 
Your guys go first. There's a pile in, in the ruins. Okay, so three inches down. That means everyone's in play. And I've got the camera looking in the wrong area. We all do. Because I'm a fool. So there's two for the sergeant and two for the missile boys in there. Good, it's over here. What's his yep. weapon skill? He's weapon skill five. Okay, so five's to hit. One goes in. Toughness is five. He's toughness five, yeah. Okay, and five to wound. No wound. I feel a crumping coming. By the tax. Charge. Wow. Two hit. I have an attack squig. So let me reroll one. So three hit. And I just need two of these. So three are dead. Okay. And that's the whole squad. That's the squad wiped. And he can start the next four inches. Somewhere. Decide that later. Yeah. And now onto this squad. So your guys go first. My guys will focus all on your mega norm. Okie dokie. Okay, so two for Sarge and one, two, three, four, five, six. Everyone piles in. Blip. There's three chaps actually in the building because I thought that was a good idea. And my fingers Just are ma that, my fingers are massive and fat, so we're not gonna get them. Okay, two for Sarge plus one, two, three. Four, five, and six. So eight, eight attacks total. It's fours to hit, fours to wound. So. Five, three, four, and five. Like I said, depth perception. Fours, which is three mm. wounds. So three two ups. All made. Oh. So now it's the killer can attacks. Which are so different. Shrimp 7, 82. Uh, he only hits with one though. His weapon skill is terrible. And that is one. Okay. And the Meg Knobs. Fours. Three. Killing on two, so two more dead. Uh -huh. I lost that combat by lots. Uh, how many died? Three died. So leadership minus three. Leadership of nine with the sergeant. Can, can. Actually, Jason. So I have initiative two. Okay, we get to initiative four. So, you've got the last one. Yeah, either way you escape. Okay. I shall make them run to this point here, at the seven. Menor's Casale's six, and my death, uh, Killer Can Casale's five. So, they'll be chasing them. Very good. And that was the turn done. Hooray. So that was a painful turn five for me. So we see there are more angels running away, because that's what we do apparently. And that is pretty much, that group there is all I have remaining, compared to the entire orc mob. Moving very swiftly on to turn five. All right, the last Dark Angel survivors, the final four, they have uh, retreated to the palmy trees over there and the brush was being chased by the killer can mega knobs and big red is still looming in that building and that's where my uh, mega knob consolidated further into deployment to get line breaker and I still have hold of the relic with the pain boy who is by now probably incredibly drunk Whee. as we all approve so that is a very short movement, of course. Um, yeah, Gaz has felt the pain a bit. It's amazing. Mm. But we're, we've been enjoying ourselves, and we're hoping you're all at least bearing with our terrible mistakes. So, now we shall uh, continue into the shooting phase. So, yep.
this shrimp base is going to be very, very short. But we still have plasma, so we're going to fire everything at the two Meganops there because of reasons. Go for it. Just make sure the bolt guns. Everyone's in rapid fire. So we've got our two plasma shots out of the way first. Emperor protects. And twos. So that is uh, Three and two wounds. Yes. So one Meganop is dead. Okay. And finally six sh six shots from the bolt guns. Which is quite pathetic. Yeah. And fours. Um, <laughs> oh, you still killed one. Yeah. Turn five for the orcs. Yeah. So that was abysmal. Yeah. Turn five orcs. Right. So pretty much the orcs' thing is everything has been coming towards this corner to finish off the final four dark angels. So. Yeah. The Valiant Last Stand for the Dark Angels. And onto the Orc shooting phase. Which will be bloody and brutal. One may hope. And maybe humorous if this misses, because I'm gonna risk it. <laughs> Kill cannon shot. Onto him. <laughs> oh yeah, take that risk. Cat is literally one inch there. Oh. So, still free. Yep, still gets free. And twos, so three. Uh, you'll get cover save because my guys are in front. Okay then, so what, five? Five, yep. Okay, we're going for a five up cover on this. Oh, one, one makes. One takes. Okay, from the front rank. That's them two. The numbers are dwindling by wagons, big shooters, snap shooting, same unit, one of them actually hits. Good lord. And does wound. So that's another armor save. Yay! Uh, killer cans, big shooter, one to the last two guys. One of them hits. And wounds. So armor save. Comes another three. Yay! They're making more power. Yep. You have to kill him in combat. So his twin link shoot. So hit. Nope. Okay. Big red twin link shooter onto the same two guys. One hits. And that is not a wound. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna finish off in combat. Doing well boys, doing well, keep it up, keep it up. So, we're gonna attempt to charge with what you call the mega knob. Meganob has got seven inches, which mm -hmm. will make the diff distance. Indeed it will. But we get the overwatch. Oh boy. Oh, okay. We fail. So he's in. Big red. Stand by. Oh, he's definitely in. Oh, I'm guessing that's huge. Oh, yes, yeah, 10. That's a massive 10. And the killer can. It's tempting. Uh, minus two. So he fails. Okay. That went well. You guys go first. Hey! Alright, we're gonna swing at the Mega Dog because it's like the only one I can actually do anything to. Okay, so force to hit. And nothing at all. Alright. Five. Five attacks from Big Red. Oh my god. <laughs> Luckily, he has an attack squig. One hit. And one is dead. Okay, and but his buddy should be able to finish him off. And he is dead. And that's the final roll. So, a bloody battle for sure. Orcs took quite a few losses, uh, but the Dark Angels took a lot more. Before yeah. they have been unfortunately wiped off the board. Whee! But I've had fun. I think Gaz might have had fun. Hell yes. Yeah, so. Yes, I'm skin boy. Put it on camera. On Get camera. Check. And no hard feelings. Yeah, <laughs> so. Good game. We appreciate you for uh, bearing with us, jeez. 
next time we will do better. I promise.